Value Trades. Welcome to this week's Market Blast Technicals. I'm Brad Alexander, and on behalf of Value Trades, today we will take a look at Aussie Swiss, Pound Dollar, Euro Pound, and the S&P 500. Yesterday, the markets were a bit confused with investors seeing the latest variant of coronavirus, the Delta, as being serious enough to affect their decisions. The big losers were the pound, the stock indices, and crude, which was also affected by OPEC, of course. This, however, gives us a technical opportunity to buy the stock indices like the S&P 500, where we can buy the dip. Keep an eye on this lower trend line, watch the fundamentals, and use an indicator like the stochastic oscillator to confirm the reversal. We promised to look at a couple of pairs in yesterday's video, but the pound took a hit with Euro pound breaking through this upper trend line, so our technical short will have to be postponed. Price action did, however, hit a key level of resistance, but we are still seeing bullish signals, so be careful and watch the fundamentals. Also, the weak pound saw pound dollar breaking this level of support with more bearish signals, and if we look at the daily chart, we see price action trying to break this level of support from March. Last week, we pointed out this rising wedge on Aussie Swiss and how it might be a bearish pattern and price action didn't disappoint us. We now see price at a key level from last year and if we break this level of support, we have room to move even lower. Don't forget to register for next week's webinar, 27th of July, and a link will be available at the end of this video. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and register on the Value Trades website to get notifications on new content as it happens. That's all for now. Happy trading with Value Trades and we will see you later in the week with our trading tips video. CFDs and FX are leveraged products and your capital may be at risk.